The Library of Alexandria was one of the most renowned and significant libraries of the ancient world, located in the city of Alexandria, Egypt. It was built during the reign of Ptolemy II Philadelphus in the third century BCE. The library is often associated with the Museum, a Greek institution for philosophical and scientific research, and together they formed a center of learning and scholarship in the Hellenistic world. The library is said to have housed an immense collection of scrolls, manuscripts, and texts from various cultures, making it a beacon of knowledge and intellectual exchange. Estimates of the size of its collection vary, with some ancient sources suggesting it could have contained hundreds of thousands of scrolls. One of the library's notable features was its dedication to collecting knowledge from around the known world. Ships arriving at the port of Alexandria were searched for books, and any that were found were copied. The copies were kept in the library, and the originals were returned to the owners. Tragically, the Library of Alexandria faced several incidents that led to its decline and eventual destruction. The most famous event associated with the library's destruction is the burning, which occurred in stages over several centuries. The exact details are unclear, but it is often attributed to a series of incidents. The library relied heavily on papyrus scrolls for its collection. The decline of papyrus production, coupled with the shift to parchment, may have contributed to a decline in the library's importance. The library was located in a city that experienced political and religious upheavals. Conflicts between different religious and philosophical schools of thought may have played a role in the library's decline. The story of the Library of Alexandria serves as a cautionary tale about the fragility of cultural heritage and the importance of preserving knowledge for future generations.